Hi Water Signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Welcome back to my channel and thank you for tuning into your weekly tarot reading. We're going to be looking at what's coming up in the week ahead for you. Uh, so it is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or to the cross watchers dealing with one of these signs. Um, this reading is going to be for you. So uh, look, before I begin, um, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Uh, and also, if you wanted to become a channel member, you will get access to member-only content. Um, otherwise, let's get into this reading and have a look what's coming up for you, what are signs in the week ahead. Let's look at the overall energy that the week has for you. Okay, what do we have? We've got three of cups. Um, this is powerful because I feel like you're getting more comfortable in a situation. Now, it is the friendship card. So for some of you, there's something around a blossoming friendship or like becoming friends with someone again. Like this is having a happy resolution between you and a person. Now, it could be between several people. So uh, what are signs? You might be doing a group thing. There might be a group event. I feel like you're patching up friendships or relationships. And this is really positive because it goes to show there's more harmony being injected um, into that. So, I mean, some of you might be like going through options in your love life and you know, there might be people wanting to come out of the friend zone. Friendships could be blossoming into relationships for a lot of you. Um, it could be vice versa. Like some of you are going from friends to lovers. Others might be going from lovers to friends. Some of you like haven't been in contact with a person and who knows, you might be friends again. You might be speaking again. Um, but I feel like there's a celebration and like people are supporting you in your decision. So I feel like whatever you choose for yourself people are in your corner and they're wanting they're wanting what's best for you okay okay i feel like there might be an intimidating situation some of you, I get what are signs you want. You want to patch things up with like this person or this energy. But I'm getting that it's like intimidating or you feel guilty for some reason. It's like there's an elephant in the room. So there's obviously something you need to address with that person. I think this is going to be the time you do it because I feel like um, justice is coming up. So that's saying that you're going to reach some sort of agreement or you're going to come to like, I'm getting like agreement and being civil. Oops. So like if you're going through like a divorce, if there's been a separation, if you're fighting over assets or you're sort of something's been unfair, I feel like you're finally making things fair. So this is good. It shows progress and it shows a situation that was one sided um, coming to be more. OK, you've got the four of ones here. This is like the marriage or the relationship card, but it's reversed. So I'm getting there might be delayed plans. Um, or friends could be getting in the way of a relationship here or like your friends are telling you don't be in a relationship don't get married don't do this be single you know I feel like especially if you have a lot of single friends they're gonna have a big influence over you like maybe because they don't have love they might not want you to have love either or like they don't they're, they're feeling lonely so they're like no you know come with me let's do this together so you know you you got to be mindful of that five of cups I see some of you getting over a loss here water signs something you've been mourning like or something that you've lost maybe in the last five weeks, five months. I see you finally letting go of that loss and finally healing. So that's that's very positive. It might be something you ended with maybe a fire or a water sign that's coming up. Um, but we do have a Libra. So this air sign, um, anyone who's dealing with like a Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, this person has a heavy presence in your reading. Um, and it's almost like it's, it's quite an intimidating... It's quite an intimidating read. She's like rising from the phoenix, like a phoenix from the ashes. So I see someone's making a comeback. It could be under the sign of a Libra here. So maybe any air sign, they may be coming, making a comeback into your life. Um, they're trying to make things right. And some of those things may involve them coming back to you. Okay, it could also be a contract of some kind. Some of you have like a new work contract. It's a lease. It's a living situation. It's a legal contract that may be coming your way. Um, but I feel like it's something you've gone after. Uh, and I think it's it's fair. Okay, this is living with maybe new people, new housemates. 
You're getting exposed to a lot of different new people here, I feel, uh, water signs this week. The Four of Pentacles is, is reversed here, so I feel like I'm getting a sense of letting go. Some of you are letting go of something. Um, now, it could be like career-oriented, or maybe it's with an Earth sign, or like letting go of a living situation. It's something you've had in the physical life, like it might be a piece of jewelry, it might be something sentimental, it could be a relationship with an Earth sign. I see you I see you letting go of that water signs. This is no longer clinging to something here. This is able uh, being able to let go and I definitely feel like emotionally you're cutting ties with something that's really been weighing you down. I think coming into that number 3 vibration with the 3 of cups, um I feel like you're you're doing something quite big in your life. And I feel like you're either starting something new in the middle of something or you're ending something because of that number three is about births, um, lives, deaths, you know, beginning, middle, endings. So there's a huge milestone that I feel like you're crossing and it may have something to do with these things, but I feel like karmic energy is coming back to you. So I feel like you're clearing some karma as you do this. Like you might be doing it consciously, you might be doing it subconsciously. Um, but it's in the cards here for you. So I get that you're clearing your karma and maybe that's helping you letting go of a situation here. I also feel like some of you are turning your back on a connection or relationship and you're listening to your friends a lot. Again, your friends are going to have different things to say about different situations. They're all coming in with an agenda. They've all had different experiences. So, you know, it, it's important to take everything with a grain of salt and not obviously live by gospel you're going to make that ultimate last decision here, water sign. So I feel like that's super important for you. Um, but I don't know, I get that this, this seven of ones is like, you're still, there's something that you're still resistant about that you're not sure. So you're still resisting a situation and I feel like it's around a fire sign or I feel like there's some anger that's still... You're still dealing with some anger here, water signs. Like there's still something that you are, like it's intimidating. You can't ignore it. It's so like in your face and it keeps coming up. So you obviously haven't dealt with some things. You know, this might be on a more conscious level. You think you're getting over something, but there's something here that still, maybe still keeps you up at night. Maybe still crosses your mind. Maybe you still feel anger and, hostil and hostility towards a person or a situation. So... Um, you know, that, that could be the case here as well, but, um, I'm going to leave it there for you this week, what a sign. So I do hope that it has been helpful. Um, I really appreciate you tuning in. So thank you everyone. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. I'd love to have you on my YouTube family or a part of my YouTube family, I should say. And also if you want, wanted to become a channel member, you can do so via the join button and that's going to give you access to member only content on the channel um, as well. So thank you again, Water Signs, for tuning in and hopefully we'll be in touch soon. Have a fantastic week and bye for now.